Welcome to my YouTube channel Mechanical Magic Mechanical Learning Tutorials. So in this video I am talking about a principle of simple indexing which would be used for dividing the periphery into equal number of parts. So in my past videos it will be well explained for how the indexing mechanism is being used to dividing our periphery of a gear blank into equal number of parts. So now see the principle of the simple indexings. So generally as from the de definitions of a uh, simple indexing. So it is carried out the using 40 inch to 1 ratio of the warm and warm wheel mechanisms which already discussed in my previous lectures. So one rotation of the warm rotates the warm wheel spindle 1 by 14th of the complete turn. So in the simple way 40 rotations of the index crank so that will be one complete rotation of the workpiece material. So by the simple indexing mechanism consists of a 40 teeth worm wheel fastened to the spindles a single start worm a crank for turning the work shaft and on index plate and the sector arm. So let us see the example of a simple indexing so now the calculation for the 20 teeth of the gears so by the definition of a simple indexing that should be 40 divided by capital N so N that will be the required number of divisions onto the gear blanks so just put the value of N over here so 40 divided by 24 so finally you will get 8 by 3 so it should be right like this 2 into 2 by 3 tons are required that means what 2 complete tons of an index crank is being required initially so this means that the index crank should be rotated 2 full rotations and followed by the 2 third of the rotations so now I am interested for calculation of the second elements like two third fractions so just you can concentrate over here for the fraction two by three so now the important point is the selection of an which kind of index plate is being used for dividing the periphery into 24 equal number of parts so let us see over here so just you can see for the fraction two by three now from here we are selecting brown and sharp system with the plate number 1 with 15 whole circle system over here. So just we can concentrate over here for the brown and sharp milling machines with the plate number 1 over here. 15 Y so that will be easily you can make a fraction into the required whole number systems. So 3 multiply by the 5 and that will be converting into 15. You can also select the 18 it will be also possible if it will be plate number 2 so you can also selecting a 21 27 and 33 so you can select either plate number 1 or plate number 2 so here I am selecting a plate number 1 with the brown and sharp system with the 15 whole circle systems so let us see over here what happened so simply just put the value over here for the 15 so 3 into 5 like 15 so 10 holes that mean that means what for the required 24 teeth of an gear blank select the brown and sharp with the plate number 1 with 15 hole circle system index crank should be rotated to full rotation which will be indicating from here with the 10 holes for each division to make 24 teeth on a gear blank so if you are interested to select some another plates with another system like this just you can concentrate over here right now I am selecting the same brown and sharp systems with the plate number 2 with the 18 hole circle system so what happened just you can concentrate over here so here instead of the 15 it will be the 18 so it will be the 6 so just you can see 6 into 2 you can say that it will be the 
12 holes so here it will be the 18 hole circle system with the plate number 1 so your answer like this for the required 24 teeth select the brown and sharp system with the plate number 1 with 18 hole circle and index crank should be rotated two full turns with an here it will be the 12 holes for the each division to make 24 teeth on a gear plank so in such kind of problems for the calculating of an required number of the plank for the making a gear so that will be the multiple answers will be possible just you can follow the standard procedures to make the simple division of a gear blank so if you understand then like and share mechanical magic mechanical learning tutorials thank you very much